let me show you why you should never play this game for money. This is the famous three shell game. The game is simple. The P starts under the central cap. The caps get moved around and all you have to do is bet on where you think the P will end up. Seems simple, right? But this game is over 500 years old and people still get conned by it every single day. So I'm gonna show you what moves to watch out for. So watch the P, watch the cap. Now this first move here is called the cross steal. See, as my hands cross, I got it out from this one and underneath this one here. This move here is called the swipe. See, as my hand swipes in front, I got it out this one here and underneath this one here. Of course, then you've also got the double swipe, which looks like this. So again, as my hand swipes in front, I could have got it out from either of these two and underneath this one here. So as you can see, this game is not quite so easy to win. However, I'll simplify it by just using two caps. Now this is the confusion move. I move the caps very quickly over the P to try and confuse you. Then when I do the move, maybe you're not quite so sure. Now, many of you would probably bet on this one here, but even if you bet on this one here, you'd still lose because it'd always be under the one you didn't expect. In fact, some people say that the only way you could ever win this game is if the operator stood with his hands away from the table, but then it wouldn't be much of a game. However, I'll take this hand and put it behind my back to make this game a little bit fairer. So watch the P, watch the cap. Caps get moved around. Where would you bet? One, two, or three? Now, people that were watching would probably go for number two. People that were just guessing would probably go for number three. But very few of you would stay on track and realize the P is in the hand behind my back. And this is why you should never play the three shell game for money.